Well, what a difference a week makes, you know, or in this case, a couple of weeks. Uh, uh, you know, we, we were played really efficiently and effectively against Colgate. And then, uh, you know, Bucknell's, a, a, they have the best defense in the league. Uh, and they've had it for a couple of years and they make it really hard because uh, it's feast or famine. Uh, they, they pressure, they take chances. And, you know, the game is, you know, TFL, one yard gain, then you can get a big gain. And, and that's the way it's been every time we played them. Um, and really it's come down to like every game is how we handle the ball. And last year when we beat them, we didn't turn the ball over. They did. This year, we were loose with the ball. Uh, we had some unfortunate uh, occurrences with the ball. All, all our tip passes just fell into their hands. Theirs just fell harmlessly to the ground. Um, and, you know, it was a remarkable game with the ball, actually, because they, they got a lot of fortunate breaks with it. We got some unfortunate breaks. Do you know, do you know we, we, we got our hands on three kicks, two extra points and a field goal, and they all went in for them. Like, when was the last time that happened? That you, def you deflect kicks and they all go in. Uh, so we, we, uh, when, when you go minus four in turnover, you could be, you know, you could be, uh, you know, the 1972 Dolphins and you're going to lose. Um, so the percentages are, are, are against you. Um, so, and give credit to them. They did a good job offensively. They, uh, we're able to create some big plays. They have, they have a lot of talent on offense. They have the best receiver in the league. Um, they have good runners. They have two talented quarterbacks. Uh, you know, so they're, they're good and you have to play well against them and, uh, and well against their schemes. Uh, and, uh, and they, they play better than us and they handle the ball better than us. So that's a simple way of, of explaining why we lost and they won't. I really think this game is important because a lot of times it's, it's the last game of the season. And sometimes what just goes through your head is like, wow, like I'm not going to be able to play with the, the guys that's next to me no more. So that always give me a little bit more juice to go out there and send those guys out with a, with a win. And uh, I just think that's amazing because, I mean, you build in lifelong relationships with people throughout your four years. And the fact that like, this is going to be the last time you play with them. It just, that's something that just like sometimes like hurt your heart for real. Definitely going to go out there and attack. Um, I know they're going to uh, definitely come out, try to bully us and try to um, get on, get on us just because how it went last year and how we celebrated last year and it was on their home field. So I know they're going to try to come do the same thing, but uh, same weekend, week out, we want to attack, run the ball, pass the ball efficiently and, um, just get the job done. Like Malik said, uh, we're gonna, we wanna go out with a win and that's our main goal. So I know a lot of our players in the fall when they cancel the season or whatnot, we're definitely really bummed out. We thought maybe there's a chance we never could play football again or whatnot. I know a lot of us kept on working, kept on practicing, kept on hitting the weight room out of season, but in the back of our head, there's always like that, that scary thought, like, could this ever be, could this be our last time ever playing football? So definitely coming into this spring season, given that extra chance to play football with this with this awesome team definitely made me not take it for granted and really just enjoy every single day. And I feel like every day I'm out there, I'm not really playing to put points on the board or to to get all these crazy awards. I'm really playing to just have fun and play with my teammates and just have the best time I can out there. So definitely just taking advantage of every single day I have out there, having fun with my teammates in the locker room. There's a little conversation you have walking from uh, walking to the dining hall after practice. Just each of those little moments, just take advantage of and really enjoy every moment we have together.